morning, everybody. Wow, what is that noise I hear? Good morning, everybody. I'm on the east side of Indianapolis, and I've been very lucky through my career to always interview interesting people who have interesting habits. I wrote a book about, I, I wrote a book about, uh, what was that? Anyway, uh, the gentleman who lives here, his name is Henry Pelk, and he had an odd hobby. Wait a second, I think that's him right now. Hold on, here he comes. Okay, good job. Oh, come come on. <laughs> I'm telling you. Don't, don't hit me. Good morning. <laughs> I remember you. Yeah. Henry, good to see you. You probably don't, I know you do remember this. When I wrote a book about interesting people, I was going to say strange, who lived in Indianapolis, you were in my book. Yeah. Tell us why you were in the book. Uh, something to do with AstroTurf. I had a dream back in 1980, yeah. and uh, I consumed it, just kept doing things in that outdoor carpet. You you are considered called the Turfmeister. Yep. The yeah. Turfmeister. And this is just a little AstroTurf, but you've done big projects. Yep. Your most famous was called? The Pink Floyd Band. Okay, and as we look at that, tell me a little bit of the history about that. Why did well, you do that? Well, it was a 94 when I bought it brand new, and I uh, decided to do it in carpet, and I decided the Pink Floyd was my first eight track, so right. that's how I got involved with the Pink and Floyd. And why did you do it really just to be do something different? Well, it was a dream. I it mean, really I had was a, a dream. The first one I had was a 69 GMC, yeah. and it was all beat up and rusted, so right. I turned around and I covered up the rust with the carpet and done the hubcaps. And, and this is the great part of the story. You decided to go in business because you thought thousands of people would flock to you for this. Did <laughs> yeah, that well, work? it didn't did work that? out that it way. <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't sell, but there is some advantage to this. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah. It covers up the dents. It covers up the dents, and how does it deal with water and everything? Very yep, cool. Go through that automatic car wash if you want to. All right, I'll tell you what we're gonna do. Can I jump in? Sure. We're gonna go to Henry's um, workshop and see what the Turfmeister can do. So we'll see you in the next segment. Bye-bye. Let's see you